everyone, welcome to another video that I am going to hopefully be able to post on this YouTube channel. So my name is Juliana, and I will be showing you... Oh, no. <laughs> I'm very bad at making videos. Oh my goodness. So if you've already continued watching, thank you. <laughs> so this is clear slime that I've made before that is really sticky. I, it's like hard to get off your hands. So I'm going to give you three tips to help you not get clear slime stuck to your hands. So everyone says that you're supposed to let clear slime sit for at least three to four days before you use it so it will be clear. That is true, but what you should do is every now and then, oh my goodness, no, is every now and then poke your clear slime and take it out for a second and just stretch it and then put it back and let it sit. And and that is during the three or four days so your slime won't get sticky. Did I say five packs? I hope it did. Um, anyway, also what you can do is get a Ziploc or um, like an airtight kind of box and use that because with clear slime you don't want air because that will make air bubbles and that will be less clear. Okay. Also, what you want to do is try to find bright glitters if you're going to put glitter into your slime so it will pop out more and actually show the clearness of your slime. So that's like three or something. I hope. Also with clear slime, what you can do is make a really good spiral, which I can't do. Because to do this, you can't fold it or anything because there's like no layers. So to do this, I'm just going to stretch your slime and just wrap it kind of like around here. I'm not really good at doing that because this is not so really sticky. Okay, that one does not work. Fail. Okay. Okay, for number four, because that one didn't. What you can do is dissolve your baking soda in a glue bottle with water. So, like, your, your glue should be empty, and you should put water in a glue bottle. And, let's say it's like the glue that you used that day. And dissolve your baking soda into that water so you can just kind of, like, spray your baking soda and water solution into your your kind of, like, your, your, your glue. Because, like, you know, it's not slime yet. And that can help with clearness too, because baking soda and contact solution, if you use that for clear slime, to make clear slime, that'll work really well because that'll make it clear because like tide kind of makes it cloudy. And so is baking soda if you don't dissolve it. So this one I dissolved, and this is what it looks like. I actually use that water technique for this one, but I didn't put enough contact solution in. Like most of the time I put too much contact solution or, or not enough. Also, what you can use is contact solution. Here's number five. What you can use is contact solution to make it more clear. Otherwise, it it's cloudy, and you don't want that. Otherwise, it's not really clear slime. I actually really hope this video is really good because if not, I I fail. <laughs> so, guys, please leave a thumbs up for me trying to do my best. That's right. I'm using books to hold my phone not sorry okay anyway if you guys would like me to do diys please leave an idea for me to do in the comments down below or you can dm me on instagram it is jules.drizzoli oh no it's on the floor oh my goodness okay you can do that too it is a private account so if i don't know you you cannot obviously ask me on instagram but you can ask me in the comments down below so if this happens to be the first video you seem to be I'm sorry, I'm really better at videos. Anyway, subscribe and like this video if you liked this video. If not, that's okay, you can dislike. So anyway, bye!